adding text to your poster is very straightforward if a little fiddly. The first thing to do is to go to the insert tab and then choose text box. If I want to add a heading above my picture all I need to do is simply click above it and then I can type in. I'm not too worried about the placement or the size of this at the moment because as you'll probably know with text being a vector graphic I can resize and edit that without affecting the quality. So unlike images I don't have to get everything spot on to start with. However with something like an A0 poster where I'm working with the entire thing on screen I'm working at quite a reduced zoom level so in the bottom right hand corner here you can see that currently I'm working at a zoom level of 16%. I can zoom in using the plus icon, the slider or I can click and type in a percentage zoom that I feel comfortable working at. This just makes it easier to do the fine tuning. So once I've done that I can click, I can drag and reposition my heading. I might also want to highlight the heading and make a few alterations such as increase the size slightly, make it bold and then again reposition it. PowerPoint gives you some guidelines when you're either at an edge, you can see the hatching down the left hand side to indicate that it's at the edge, or in the centre, or at the right edge. So that's a handy method of quickly aligning your text or your images. As well as typing text in, you can also copy and paste from other sources. I've got some text in a Word document that I'm now going to copy and paste into my PowerPoint presentation. In order to paste this text into my poster, all I need to do again is scroll down to roughly where I want the text to go, select insert, choose text box, and then click. Once I type that in, the text will go in in line. A solution to this is to actually define the width of the text box and then paste. The text will then move down the page but keep the width. Either way, I obviously need to edit the text, and all I'm going to do here is Control A to select it, and then I'm going to reduce the font size down to something suitable for the poster. As before, if there are tweaks that you need to make, simply select the text, the text box will then appear, and you can either expand, contract, or change the layout. If you want to get an idea of roughly what the image or the text will look like in your final poster, simply move the zoom level up to 100% so that you can check the quality of your image and also the legibility of the text. In the next video we'll look at adding and manipulating shapes.